Hi, and welcome to another video of Reactor Tutorial Series. In this video, we are going to build the image for the Raspberry Pi, specifically for the Raspberry Pi 3. So, in this tutorial, you are going to learn what is Raspberry Pi Metalier, where to find it, and how to clone it. Then, we will see the available Raspberry Pi machines in that layer, and then we will build for the Raspberry Pi 3, and I will also tell the steps that are required to build the other Raspberry Pi images. So let us begin. First of all, I'll open my browser and I'll go to Google and I'll, I'll type open open embedded layer index. And I'll go to the first layer here. Here, what I'll do is I'll type here First, I will go to the machines and I will type Raspberry. And you can see that here the column for the machine names, and here are a lot of machines. And then here is the layer. So, this Raspberry Pi layer is the layer that provides the Raspberry Pi multiple machines. So, we will click on this layer, and here we have this Git repo. We will copy it and we'll and we will go back to our terminal. In terminal, we'll go to our Poki folder, and in the Poki folder, we are going to clone it. But we are working with Kirkstone branch, so we have to clone the Kirkstone branch. So I'll do git clone minus p Kirkstone, and I'll paste the link. And then I'll press enter. So the repo has been copied. Now we have to see what available machines are there for the Raspberry Pi. What other Raspberry Pi machines do we have? Uh, we have multiple Raspberry Pi, Raspberry Pi 0, 1, Raspberry Pi 2, 3, 4, and so on. So we will go inside the meta layer, meta Raspberry Pi layer. And here we will type find minus i name inverted com inverted commas star dot conf then the space pipe function uh, pipe uh, uh, we'll say pipe and then I'll, I'll do grab and after grab I'll do here machine so as you can see that in this folder we have about a dozen machines for the Raspberry Pi. We have Raspberry Pi 2, Raspberry Pi 3, 4, 64 bit, only Raspberry Pi, Raspberry Pi 0, 2W, and so on. So I will try to build for Raspberry Pi 3. So uh, I have Raspberry Pi 3. That's why I will be building for Raspberry Pi 364 version, but you can see that there are two Raspberry Pi 3 machines, Raspberry Pi and Raspberry Pi 64. So this Raspberry Pi 3 is just a 32-bit version, and this is 64-bit version. So you can build either of them. Same for the Raspberry Pi 4. Here is a 64-bit version, and do we have here? Yeah, here is the 32-bit version. So to do that, first of all, we need to add it in our pblayer.conf. To add it to pblayer.conf, I'll go to my Pogi folder and I will source my environment. Then I'll do bit bake layer add layer and it will be meta specify. So the layer should be added. Let us see. So yes, you can see that the Raspberry Pi layer has been added. Now we'll go to local.conf and here we have this default machine. Uh, we'll overwrite it. We'll come to the end. And what we'll do here is uh, the end here somewhere. And here I'll do 
machine and here we will write this machine it's ready by 364 so let me copy it and then I'll paste it here so now in our build folder here we will again build a code image full command line so we'll do again the pick or match full command line. So the build should start now. image has been built it will take a while I guess and you can see that the image has been built has been built successfully so now we will check the image for that I'll go to pokey and but I have created another source folder so I'll go back and here I will go to sources and sources temp deploy images and here you can see there are different uh, uh, folders for different uh, ports so we have right now Raspberry Pi 364 bit so Raspberry Pi 3 and here you can see the a lot of files that we have the device she drop only and so on so but the uh, file that we need I guess is uh, here uh, here you can see that it is a uh, wic file this or this so in the next video I will show you how to flash the file in the Raspberry Pi and we will see this in action now uh, if we want to build for some different board for that what we need to do is for example if you have Raspberry Pi 5 or Raspberry Pi 4 or any other version of Raspberry Pi so you have to check again in Meta Raspberry Pi and you will do find iname uh, star.conf and then we will do pipe and then grab machine so here are all Raspberry Pi machines available. So what you need to do is you can just put simply the machine here uh, in place of uh, Raspberry Pi 364 bit. You can put any of them. Furthermore, you can also use the distro file to put. So if you have a distro file, so you don't need to put the machine in here. You can just put the distro file, but I will not recommend this. I will recommend that you put in this uh, uh, machine in local.com. So if somebody else is using this distro so he's not bound to use only Raspberry Pi 3 for uh, this so yeah put it here like this so this is all about how to build the image for Raspberry Pi with Yocto so I hope you like this video please like and subscribe my channel and I will see you in the next video thanks for watching